I'm not even sure if I can actually contain my excitement right now, but I just got an email from Techland, the people who made this game, and they got an early preview build I can play. This looks close to what it should be like. I mean, if they fix anything, I'd be very surprised, but I know that this is not the final product and all that, but I'm just glad I get to play this game early for you guys. Um, I'm not sure how far I can go into the campaign, but I'll show the start like I do any other series, but... This is a thank you to them. I hope to see this video do well, and maybe if it does, I can post more. Uh, so, if you guys can, I would love to see this video do amazing. I don't have a like goal or anything. 50,000 likes would be insane, uh, and it would definitely be appreciated. So, uh, with that being said, let's do this. I hope to be able to show you as much as I can. And I, I honestly can't believe it's December and I'm playing a game that comes out in January. So, with that being said, let's do this. HUD activated. Commence briefing. Approaching Iran. Data on the subject. Kadir Suleiman. A local political figure hired to maintain order after the outbreak. His brother Hassan died in a disease-related incident before we were able to evacuate him. Suleiman blamed the GRE for Hassan's death. He stole a highly sensitive file which became his bargaining chip against the GRE, with instructions to publicize it if anything happened to him. Data on the subject. The stolen file. In 10 seconds. It details the incomplete process of synthesizing a cure for the virus. If implemented in its current state, the produced substance may be extremely toxic. Now. Also, the file contains full description of the virion structure. Any attempt to use it would result in countless lives lost. It must be recovered. Further information, current status. Suleiman sent the file to an associate unknown to us, with instructions to publicize it at his command at any time. To counter that, we instituted a citywide communication jam, preventing him from publicizing the file. Your GRE-issued radio can overcome that jamming. It is your lifeline. Do not lose it. Suleiman has since gone underground and begun using a different name. We have reason to believe he now leads one of the two main factions operating within the city. You are to find Suleiman and locate the stolen file in order to save mankind from a disaster of unprecedented proportions. I told you that wasn't a normal drop shoot. Break his legs, then take him to rides. Back up! All of you! Stop! Loud noises draw them! Fall back! Fall back! Him. You're scared. Not scared. Then pinch him. He blinked. What? 
He blinked again! What if he's a zombie? Ah! Zombie! Run! <sighs> Shit in my head. So I must tell you right now, this is one of the best looking games I've played in quite some time. Um, I'm actually able to play this, and I'm not sure how far I'm able to go, but I am very excited. The game, I, I played a preview build, god, at least had to have been like a year ago. Looks nothing like this. This is such an improvement over that, so I'm not sure if this is going to be what the final version looks like, but if it is, I mean, it looks better than most games do now. Uh, just so you guys know, I am playing on PC. I wanted to kind of get the maximum, I guess, potential out of this game. You sleep for three days like a dead man that scared children? Off to a great start, everyone. Where am I? In paradise, can't you see? Okay, enough joking around. Head to room 190. The boss will brief you. What do you mean, 31? Ask the boss. I was gonna tell you, since this is pretty much gonna be a part one just like all my other series, uh, I'm going to be doing a giveaway. Any system preference, I think it's only available on Xbox One, PS4, and PC. So, I'll give away two copies of this, any system, for those three at least. And I just if you want a chance to win, just leave a comment below. I figured I would just kind of say this is the start of the series. So far, this game looks Excuse amazing. Me. Your number. You're the 31st infected. I'm the 18th. Everything is counted here. One fewer doses of antizin. One more new infected. One more runner gone. It's like a Mirror's Edge, Dead Island kind of hybrid, if you would. Amir died because of this guy? Quiet. Oh, fuck quiet. Now he's gonna get Amir's antizin. I just can't believe how, how smooth this game runs. It is 60 frames a second. Go see the boss in room 190. There's 181. Let's look around. That's 180. I guess it's one above this. Let's go up these steps. Now, I'm not sure what all they have it set up to. What is this? Yep, here it is. Look at this guy chilling. I'm looking for the boss. Is he in there? Oh, you're 31. Go on in. I just want you guys to know that I've never gotten a game this early, and it's definitely a privilege, so I hope you guys enjoy this. I'll actually touch base with him and just see if I can, how, like, how far I can actually go into the game. Because this so far looks unreal. A good zombie is a dead zombie. Oh, look at the, uh, what the hell was that? Remember, kids don't go out after dark. They got instructional stuff on zombies. What does this say? mark at all. Hey, I'm looking for the... Are you the boss? What, am I too young? You got the problem with my age? No, I... You wanted to talk to me? That's better. Do you remember anything? Know what you are? Yeah, I can, I can see this is some kind of shelter. We call it the tower. Brecken and his runners put it all together a couple of months ago, and we've been here ever since. Hunting airdrops, scavenging, and rescuing people. Yeah, I, I wanted to thank that girl. Good, because if not for her, you'd already be chewing somebody's knee bone. Your antizen was totally crushed, by the way. Only thing Jade could salvage was your radio. Oh, great. So can I get that back, please? Actually, I think I need it more than you do. Believe me, pal, that's not the case. Fine. Take it. You know why runners put their lives in danger? For guys like you. So now you take the antizen meant for someone else, and you won't even share your gear with us? I don't have time to deal with your bullshit. I've lost contact with one of our guys thanks to the fucked up radios we're stuck with. Do something for me, would you? I don't want to see you or your precious radio anymore, so go be useful somewhere else. We don't tolerate lazy assholes here in the tower. Hey, be fair. I'm not, I'm not lazy. I'm just... Hey, boss. Save it. That last guy I mentioned, 
He's only on the 13th floor, but he might as well be trapped in a mine cave and come back later. And I'm not the boss. Too young, remember? I'm Rahim. Brecken's in charge here. I think it's been a while since there's been a really good zombie game. Alright, so I have to do this. Favorite zombie movie, go. For me, it always fluctuates. It definitely is not World War Z, I'll, st I'll tell you that I'm much right lazy, now. You little shit. Alright, check out the, uh, check the 13th floor for the lost survivor. I'm gonna just kind of keep looking around, like, this whole area looks amazing. Look at that! Eventually we're gonna be down there getting chased by, uh, <laughs> by God knows what. Look at this guy. He's writing down some important information. I would have to say the Dawn of the Dead uh, 2004 version is probably my absolute favorite zombie movie. Shaun of the Dead's definitely up there, though. Where do you think you're going? The 13th floor. I'm getting some stuff for Raheem. 13? Shit. That's gonna be some dirty work. But we all got to pull our weight around here, huh? Alright, here we go. Jesus, how many people died here? Crane here. Where were you? We've been waiting for your report. It's been over 70 hours. I lost my radio for a while. Don't worry, my cover's intact. No contact with the tower's leader yet. Unable to confirm identity. I'm taking steps to blend in. Acknowledged. Time is of the essence, Crane. Remember that. There's, there's one more thing. I... I got bitten. I've shown no symptoms, but the people here say I'm infected. Then you'd better get your hands on some Antizen ASAP. Help! Had you. Help! Oh, Somebody! shit! What the hell? Alright, so I'm a little nervous because we gotta find Rick's baby, apparently. We're stuck in, uh, season four, I think. Alright, we gotta shift. I don't know, is there- there's a- there's gotta be a flashlight option. Oh man, guys, I don't like this. <laughs> Bitch! Oh, that's so sick! So you can kick them while they're down. This game plays, it's like a smooth version of Dead Island. Jesus, you, you alright, man? <laughs> I cut my arm, getting away from him. Oh, God. You had to kill him, didn't you? <laughs> God damn it! That was... That was my brother. I came down to see him and... Easy, easy. It's all right now. I'll, I'll get help. Hey, Raheem, this is Crane. I'm down here on 13. Listen, this guy of yours got fucked up pretty bad getting away from a zombie. Oh, shit. 31? You went after Mark? Is it... is it safe down there? Yeah, well, it's safe enough now. Okay, don't move. I'm sending Lena downstairs. I'm just supposed to wait here? Take care of Mark. Take care as and beat his ass with this, uh... <laughs> with this thing. Hold still. Lena will be here any minute. Goss! You've got to find some goss! Oh, and alcohol! Combine them. That will stop the bleeding. Please hurry. I try to stay calm, okay? I'll be right back. I like this so far. It's like you have a... Uh... Oh, let me... F yeah, let me look at all these different rooms right here. This is probably where I get my ass eaten alive. Knew the flashlight gotta be an option sometime soon. Yeah, it's it plays. Oh my god, what is this back here? Oh, thank goodness. Oh, I was waiting for it. Who hangs up jeans, really? Listen to that soundtrack.
It's like an old Nokia phone or something. Alright, let's look behind the couch. Anything? I've already searched everywhere else. Let's look in the cabinets. Nothing. Alright, let's keep going. Rick's baby's down here somewhere. You know it. Uh, can you not just... I guess you can't. I mean, I hope I can keep playing this game for you guys. I might have to keep playing it on my own. If not, I had to leave you guys behind for a minute. This can't be good. Alright, if I'm not mistaken. What is that? Nails? There's some alcohol, finally. This is when I just turn it up and drink it. That way, that guy knows it's real. Like, sorry, buddy. You're done. I was kind of surprised to see our character. I don't know if he got bitten at the very end or what. Let me see if I can give him the alcohol right now. No, I gotta find the other thing first. Let me look back here. What is this? Duct tape. Or duct tape, excuse me. There's a toothbrush. Nothing here. Here we go. There okay, it is. I think that's everything I'm gonna find. Let's give this a shot. Now this game is 60 frames per second. All right, press. Uh, what? One to enter blueprint settings. Oh, it's I, not one. Uh, let's see. That's so sick. Just the basic of making things in this game is crisp. Okay, who's hurt? He's bleeding pretty bad. Let me see him. Goes in alcohol, huh? Pretty primitive, but it'll work. Thanks for the help. I'll take care of him from here. So I got a little bit of experience from that. Uh, let's go back over here. Hey, 31. Not bad for a new guy. Perhaps I misjudged you. Yeah, I just want to help out and repay you guys for what you did for me. Well, good. Come find me, and we'll talk about how you can do that. Alright, let's head back up the uh, little elevator. I like there's like a door, like an actual door that goes to it. Alright, let's go talk to him. I'm not sure whether, like, actually I should stop the video or not. I'm just gonna kind of keep going for now. Alright, taken care of. Piece of cake. What else you got for me? Well, let me think. Rahim, you are just smart enough to be dangerous, you know that? Omar told me about your plans for the nest. Explosive charges? Really? What? Explosives? Oh, I never please. said that. You can't tell a convincing lie to save your life. I know what I'm doing. Yeah? You think you can't die? You're not my mom. No, I'm not. Our mom's dead. So you might want to be a little nicer to me since I'm the only family you have left. Especially now that Amir is gone. You're Jade, right? Right. I just wanted to thank you for what you did for me and, and tell you how sorry I am for your loss. I owe you and Amir my life. Yeah, you do. You want to return the favor? Keep my dipshit brother from killing himself. No explosives, Rahim. When you're outside, so... So, is that enough? Do I get to talk to Brecken now? First, go change your clothes. I left some new ones for you in your room. You're in 194. Something wrong with what I'm wearing? You need something that fits the job Brecken wants you to do. Call me when you've changed. Alright, so I'm gonna go change clothes, and then that actually might be it for this video. Um, I'm not really sure how far I'm able to go. I'd like to at least find out before I try to keep going any further. Let me read this. What does this say? Jade the Scorpion. Uh, meet the three-time kickboxing world champion. There's a QR code right there. I wonder if you can scan that. Probably can. 
Our, uh, 194, that's where we're at. I like how this game plays, though. It's very, uh... It's very fast. Alright, we got player stash. This is a hint. Storage, outfits, fresh clothes. Look at the fresh clothes outfit. Look at this guy. Alright, we're good to go. Okay, Raheem, I'm ready. Where do I find Brecken? Not so fast, 31. If you're going to earn your keep, we have to find out if you've got the skills. So get your ass up to the gym. Gym? What are you talking about? It's on the top floor. Just a couple flights up. Oh, I thought I was supposed to run to the elevator again. I guess you can only go down. We'll see what happens. The tower roof. Or is there? I just want to like check out the game graphic. Look, look, look at all this. I kind of wonder if you can go to all these other spots in the game. Tempted to try to jump off. I don't think you can. No. Oh, you might can. I don't know, guys. I don't want to find out. All right, let's head back this way. I'm supposed to just keep on going up. 20? This isn't high up enough. Gotta keep going. It definitely has a good feel for it. I think people that like zombie games would definitely like this. Raheem, I don't see you. Where are you? What the hell? <laughs> Alright guys, it looks like we're supposed to run across this entire crane. I just want to kind of look at the game for a minute. I'm trying, to, I was trying to get the controls down and everything. This game so far, look at all that solid water detail. Alright, let's get out of here. I feel like he's going to start moving Jesus it again. Mary Joseph, I should be wearing a parachute for this. Yeah, this is not safe. Welcome to our gym. First things first, you've got to learn how to run. What do you mean, learn how to run? Just do what I say, alright? Now, jump down to the very bottom. Are you nuts? I'd kill myself! Don't be a wimp. Oh, come on, you can't be serious! Watch this. Raheem! My leg! Jesus, don't move! I'll get help! Ha! I was just fucking with you! Son of a bitch! What? You can't take a joke? Come on! Get your ass down here! Christ on a crutch. Is that Troy Baker on the voice? I have to know. Here we go. <gasps> Holy shit! Holy shit! <laughs> it's a rush, isn't it? But don't blow your load just yet. There's more. To survive outside, you got to take advantage of the terrain. Most eaters suck at climbing, so the harder the terrain is, the better for you. I've got some typical situations set up for you. Let's see how you handle them. So I wanted to tell you guys, thank you so much for all your support on this video, whatever it is. Uh, but anyways, I love you guys. Thanks for everything. And hopefully I can post more. We'll just see how the video does and also what they say. And uh, yep. That's it. You guys stay classy.